Good evening and well, welcome to episode 8 of the Monty and Joe Show. My name is Joe Grace, football coach at Cape Fear High School. Here with my boy Flashy Mo Montel Moore, as always. Well, 42-7 against E.E. E. Smith. We are now 8-0. Yes, that was last week's game. Feeling good about it. We played good defense. We put the points up on the board. And we avenged a loss from last year, 50-14, to which mm. we all wanted to forget that debacle. Now we finally have. What's your take on the game? It was, they were a good, solid team. You know, we won every phase of the game, defense, offense, special teams. It was a great game to be a part of. Good. Definitely was. Definitely was. Um, this week we got Jack Britt. Mm. We have not beaten them since 2004. And I know that's weighing heavily on everybody's mind. It's been talked about in the locker room. Uh, Coach Thomas yesterday put up the, the graphic on the board. Every that's year it. we've we've lost, but 2004 the only time we've ever beaten them. They've got uh, several guys rotating at quarterback. Uh, quarterback is a key position for them. A lot of difficult reads. A lot of a lot of changing personnel. A lot of different keys for the secondary and linebackers to read. So it's it's a little bit difficult defensively. What 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 do you got? Uh, what do you got? Offensive perspective. What, how about them defensively? Um, defensively, they're tough and aggressive. You know, um, they have good fast linebackers can cover well too, just as the uh, corners. Yeah, um, looking up front, they've got some some monsters up mm-hmm. there too. Some pretty big dudes. Uh, it's a pretty good solid analysis there. Their uh, nice 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 job, man. Thank you, I like it. You're, 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 you're evolving now. It's good stuff. Thank you. So, who's our guest tonight? Who we got? You know, we got our good friend, Richie Lord. Richie Lord, here he is. Mr. Energy himself. Hey, man, welcome to the Money and Joe Show. Come on in, have a seat. So, Richie, uh, first of all, I, I got to say, man, um, grading my film this past week, um, and I grade the, the defensive backs, I, I coached the secondary. Uh, for those of you who didn't know, the safeties and corners, who are the last line of defense. I'm grading film, and I see a deep pass, and, and Richie shows up on the screen. <clears throat> yeah, I just, I mean, if I messed up at all, I just sprinted as hard as I could. Yeah, I, I've noticed several times on, on deeper passes that, that, that your hustle makes up for any mistakes on the field. Yeah, I, I just try to be in on every play. I every really, play I love I the motor, man. I do love the motor. I mean that sincerely, man. I, I, it's... It's awesome to see that on film. Like, hey, man, that guy's hustling. He's selling out for the team. I like that attitude. Um, on that note, last year your, your season was cut short yeah. with an injury. Um, you know, what was it like knowing your season was over? It was pretty tough. I mean, right when I found out I couldn't play for a whole year, you know, I just – I knew I had to get prepared for the next year. That's all I could do. Well, and you you were still at practice every day. You, you never missed a practice unless you had, obviously, a, yeah. a therapy appointment or anything, something like that. But – you never lost that connection with the team, and, and that's you know how guys knew that, that you wanted to be around, wanted to be a part of the, part of the team, part of part of what we were doing here. So, but now that you're back in Atlanta, how do you feel about being on the field? It feels pretty good. It feels like I'm a part of the team again. Definitely, definitely, and, and obviously you are helping us. Um, started out uh, a little more in a special teams role, but you've transitioned to getting in a lot on on defense and. First start of the season last last week, sir. How did it feel, man? Felt oh, really good. 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 Yeah, well, you played really well too. Um, Thank so, you. And again, your hustle, your hustle is definitely an asset to the defense, and, and it adds to our team speed. So that was good. Any thoughts about Friday night? What's your outlook? Just gotta play hard. You know, we've had a good week of practice so far. Just gotta continue and get better. Okay. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll pull out a big win. Not uh, since twelve years we haven't beaten them. So. Yeah. All right, Mon. Anything else before we close? No, sir. Good stuff. Well, this has been episode eight. It's been a wild ride. We've we've had a few takes. Hopefully, one day we'll show a gag. We really did here. So poor Richie just wants to go home and go to sleep. But mm-hmm. hey, this has been episode eight. Thank you for watching. Ah, it's been fantastic. All right. Hey, if you want to follow me on Twitter, you can follow me at Have a Great Day, right there. It's, it'll be it'll be over here, right there. There it is. Okay. And again, uh, we're on YouTube. Find the channel Cape Fear Football. It's the one with the big blue and gold CF. That's all I got for this week. Come see us Friday night, 7 o'clock, at Jack Britt. Be there. Greats, out. Sure.